Dinah. Stop your squirming. You'll tip the carriage. Sit still and do your needlepoint. All I've done today is sit still. Maybe if you hadn't been fidgeting so much at dinner, Mr. Whitley may have proposed. <sighs> he was perfect. Perfectly terrible. Look, Dinah. Mr. Whitley is our only way out of destitution. Your father has already gone off and squandered away our money. What was that? Henry mustn't have secured our luggage well. Henry! Stop and secure the bags! Stand and deliver. We can't really stand in the carriage, can we? I just knocked your coachman off, woman. That gun doesn't even have any bullets. How would you know? My father is a major general. Oh, well, this is a new type of gun with new bullets and, and new things that you haven't seen before. It's sometimes they don't even need That's bullets. It. They just... They, they just... Oh! Listen up. I've had a bad day, and I've had enough people telling me what to do. So why don't you drop all the gold you have, gallop off into the sunset, and never look back? Or I'll take this needle and jab it right through you. Actually, I would find it more painful if it were in the eye. Raise your hand up a little higher, dear. Okay, okay. And also, your horse. But you you said... You know, is my only friend. Maybe if you didn't rob people, you'd have more friends. Dinah, where are you going? To make my own way in the world, mother. Hey, ah! Well, I guess a life of crime is better than being a spinster. Highwayman, you wouldn't happen to know how to drive a carriage, would you? <laughs>